Hello guys, this is Geek Squad 16. Welcome back to Let's Play Grand Theft Auto Liberty City Stories. Um, as we saw in the last video, Saboteur actually got caught by the uh, the feds and now is in jail. And we have to go to the, which is the third island of uh, Liberty City, which is Shore Shotville. Here's how you get to it. Oh man, freaking cop. Let's see here. Okay, I'm going the wrong way here. Let's go this way. We need to look for a bridge here. we actually seen this a few times when we went through here. But I couldn't do nothing because of uh, it was blocked off thanks to the rioters. And of course, in, in typical Grand Theft Auto fashion, the uh, island's not normally unlocked. Let's see. Uh, okay, that's a parking garage. I don't want to go down there. Well, that's what it looked like. That looked like a parking garage. Okay, right here, you look out for this bridge here. You can tell the barriers and that little sign's been gone. So now we can actually cross over to the third island, which is Shore Shadville. Now this one, I believe, has a uh, uh, up a retracting bridge. I guess you could say. Come on, what's the problem? Yeah. Hear that noise? That means the bridge is out. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. You gotta be careful right there because that will rise up, that bridge there. And you have to wait because if you go too early, you'll actually run into the, uh, you go in the water, and which of course is automatic death. But, anyways, guys, welcome to Shore Shot Vale. This is, like I said, the third island. This is basically the, I guess you could say, the suburb part of Liberty City. Um, I was here is home of uh, Francis International Airport, um, and as well as some other things. Uh, Wichita Gardens, and, um, yeah, some of the wealthy live, lives here, so, so, yeah. Sorry, I got a little bit tongue-tied there. But anyways, uh, let's head to, so, look out, buddy. Swore right into me. Let's head to, uh, Salvatore now. Oh, come on, buddy. Come on, man. See, so yeah, the way things are looking, it's not looking good for Salvatore, so we're going to have to figure out something. So, yeah, uh, right here in the jail right here. The uh, Liberty City Police Department, this is where Salvatore has been him. And uh, we need a lawyer's outfit to get into COC Sal. So, yes, um... So yeah, we need to be a, we need to be in a lawyer because right now we need to make a fake. I forgot about this part. Um, we need to change it to the lawyer's outfit because uh, so the police know that um, it is our lawyer. So uh, go down here to the shirt icon if I can find it. Uh, I think it maybe over this wall here. All right, over here. So yeah. I might be going back to the Leone suit later on, but as of right now, until Saboteur's out of jail, this is what we're going to be wearing. Okay, lawyer outfit is now available at the safe house, so. And here's Tony Cipriani. He's wearing glasses now. <laughs> and a nice suit. Even though the Leone suit looks better on him, but, yeah. Again, we got to disguise ourselves as a lawyer, so, so we don't cause any suspicion. Okay, so now let's head back to the police department to go and see Salvatore Leone. Yeah. All right, here we go. Okay, rough justice. He's your lawyer, Mr. Leone. I know who the hell he is, pal. Come on, give me a break here. Go ahead, kid, run along. Say hello to your mother for me, Gabish. Uh, you got five minutes. Listen, uh, Lionel, you're looking good. Look at me, a fine member of the community, and suddenly I'm banged up. It really challenges my philanthropic nature. Uh, of course, Mr. Leone, we're doing everything we can to get you out of here and uh, back to helping your community as soon as possible. 
course. I hope we can sue someone for this outrage. Those cunts, the Sindacos, or those cocksuckers, the Pirellis. Who was it? Who ratted me out? Let's hit them both hard, the way I see it. They both could use a good beat for this outrage. Motherfuckers! It will be my pleasure. Thank you. Tony. You really mean a lot to me. You know that? Listen, you might need some backup. Uh, use the hoods, okay? Whatever you think is best, Mr. Leone. All right. Get out of here, Lionel. Okay, so apparently someone, if you use this as the Sadakos or the Ferrellis, ratted Saboteur out, and that caused him to um, be in jail. But before we get this mission started, I need to plug in my laptop. I forgot to do this before I actually got started. There we go. Okay, so we need to go get some backup here, which is the hoods, and then get the Ferrellis attention. And my back is gone. Uh, take this car here. I know there's a cop there. So, oh, was there even a cop there? I can't tell. It, it sure looked like him though. Look out, people! Yo, hello, buddy. Yeah, run right in front of me, you idiot. Okay. Man, I clipped the wall right there. Ah, right, dang it, yeah, I always, you know, the one thing I hate about Short Shot Vale when you go into a destination where we need to go is you can always sometimes, sometimes go down that lower part. Right there, and, uh, yeah, I always get confused every time I come here. I just need to find that bridge, which is right up here, actually. And there we go again, I just heard the guy say something about Grilled Cheese Deluxe. If I said, like, for the 1,000th time in this Let's Play, <laughs> Okay, so it looks like it's over here at the Cook Rain Dam. Yes, follow the shore right down here. And right over here. So we have these guys right here. Lure the Ferrellis by smashing up their cars. And we have more than two people, so we we'll need a four-door car. And there's some body armor here. Right Alright, so we have the hoods. Which is their gang vehicle right here. So we're going to drop this thing. Okay, so now let's go smash some of the Ferrelli's cars here. Come on, let's Hell yeah, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> I say we'll be hitting the Sadako's heart as well, so... So yeah, because of this little outrage. Uh, let's see here. Let's go over here. Here's one of the Ferrelli's cars right here, so now it smashed this up. Uh, I don't have anything. All I have is my fist. Stack revenge on the Ferrellis. Yeah, so you have your gang members here, and they've already took this guy out. Oh. But. Ah, dang it, one of the hoodies. Yeah. Ah, oh, shoot. Need to reload there, but thankfully that car kind of helped me out right there. If they can, if the Ferrellis continue to get their attention to uh, the the gang members here that we've got, shoot, eh, I lost a tire on that car. I'm on the van here. So yeah, we're going to, have to get it repaired here. And man, how many more of these Ferrellis do we have? Uh, shoot fire. 
Where is he? Aha! There's the last one. Hide now. It's okay, so that's that first set of Ferrellis. Now let's go lure some more by smashing up yet another car. Yeah, bitch. I say so. I say so, man. And unfortunately, I, uh... Okay, let's go smash up another car, and unfortunately... We don't have to go, we don't have to go that far, so... No worry about the flat tire here. Alright, boys, let's smash this car up. Come on. It was your car. Don't have to worry about it anymore. And oh yeah, the uh, the hood, the gang members, which is the hoods, actually will have a uh, max. So that, so that's good. So one, it's not like one of the Ferrellis has a shotgun, because I hear it. That one just has a pistol. Who has a shotgun? Oh, one of our hood guys had a shotgun. Then they, then he switched back to the uh, pistol. Some of these, most of these are using pistols here. Okay, there's that guy. And there's that guy. And there we go. Yeah, one of our guys was carrying a shotgun. No, actually, no, it was the Ferrellis. I was carrying a shotgun. And there we go. So that's done and over with. Not that hard. And bike alarm. Not that hard of a mission, actually. Um, that mission was pretty sweet, but pretty easy. So it's as long as you have a good gun, like a, at least a Mac, because. And also, there was that one friend that had a shotgun, but uh, just be careful. Make sure you have your Mac and you fully stock your armor. You should be fine. Okay, so back to Salvatore we go, and I believe we should get another phone call soon. Man, I went the wrong way. There's a tunnel right there, but I, I think I wonder if that actually takes you back to uh, if that tunnel is complete. Because remember, it's under construction. Here's Tony's safe house up here on Shoreside Vale. So, so yeah. Okay, I need to figure out how to get out of here. Safe house right there. Hmm. That's a nice fast car. We'll take it. It's like a Corvette. The Phobes VT. That's not the uh, the Phoenix kind of. The old Phoenix from uh, GTA Vice City. And I already damaged it. It's a good fast car. Man, oh man, yeah, this thing's kind of hard to handle a little bit. Going, well, going fast. Ah, oh, come on, I need to get back to the jail. See, yeah, coming here to Shoreshot Vale is a can be, you can really, very easily take a wrong turn and get lost here, so. Let me look at the map here. Okay, I don't know where I need to go. Come on, Tony. Come on, man. Okay, yeah, I took a wrong turn right there. Phone call right there. That's probably another street race, but I'll do those at the at the end of the game. So, yeah. Oh yeah, uh... Oh damn! Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Or here we don't go. Alright, right to the parking lot. No, I'm just gonna take this bike here. Man, why is that everyone setting their alarms on these things? 
and that one. And our bike right here. So yeah, for, yeah, okay, so now we're good now. I just need to couldn't figure out where it was going. Okay, yeah, just okay. <laughs> I don't know what else to say right there. Oh dang. I don't know if there's any ammunition here in Source Shot Bill. There is not. So if you need any weapons or anything, you have to go back to, uh, to, uh, what you call it? Back to, uh, Stalton Island. Okay. Now then. Alright. Here we go. Dead Reckoning. With this mission. Hey Sal, it's me, Tony. Tony, it's good to hear your voice, kid. These chumps won't let me see nobody. Listen, I got plenty of business to take care of. Take Paulie Sindaco. His family's finished in this town. But he thinks he can just run away like he's got no dues to pay. I'm in jail because of that bastard. Make that son of a bitch pay. Alright, so you guys remember Polly Sendako, you know the guy uh, that we, uh, that, uh, we uh, messed his car up? We're not going to take him out and uh, we need to go intercept him over here at the dam. Alright, so here we go. So it's the uh, Cook Rain Dam. Ah, I was hoping to stay on the bike there, but eh. Kind of sucked. Kind of one of the reasons why I don't like don't like bikes somewhat in this game. That's water down there. I need to be lower. Okay. Yeah. It's gonna take a little while before, before I can get there, so. Ow! Gee! Keep her steady, Tony. Keep her steady. Okay, let's uh let me check this one more time. So I can figure out Okay. Go right right here. Stop rifle will come into handy right right about now. Yeah, we're going the right way. Okay, we should be getting close to where Polly Sendako is. Okay. Oh, really, buddy? Yeah, it's one of them aggressive drivers. So that guy's gone. Hang on. I, I'm lost. I don't know where I'm going. Okay, I think 
think this is where we need to go. Right here, over here at the at the, uh, at the dam. Well, I'm right to a wall. That's real nice. I think that is a uh, yep. I was afraid of that. It's a freaking dead end. Is it? Yep, it's a dead end. Let's turn around. Oh, well, I went down this way. I'm sorry about this, guys. I'm in this short chapel. Like I said before, it's a real easy place to get lost at. Let's see here. Uh. Come on, Polly. Okay, back here at the dam. He's down there. Let's see, what does she look like down there? Well, oh, it's going to be a big drop. I'll stay on the bike. That's good. Well, lots of way to get down here. I'll take it to the bank. There's a lot of damage to the bike, unfortunately. Okay, here we go. Oops. Guy stupidly drove into the water. And we've been spotted. Ah, oh, shoot. Kill Polly Sendaka and let him get away. Okay, so uh, we need to get some wheels and ambush Polly on the shore. Now, to be honest, that probably can easily take him out here. Are you see? He said, Tony, won't you swim over here and kiss my ass? And of course we have the Ferrellis on the shore. But you can easily take them out on land here. I'll take out the guards. So it said you can am okay, let's try this again here. Oh shoot, cop. Oh. I had to do something about that cop because I'm about to kill you, Three stars. No ah, dang it. At least that was a Ferelli, though. Dang, nab it, people. Okay. Man, now I got a free star once in a while because that cop got in the way. Okay, I'm nowhere near a paint spray though, but there's some spike strips right there. Okay, I need to check and make sure I don't go into any bodies of water. <sighs> okay, come on, where is Polly? There he is. Hey, yeah, he's too far away. I can't get it. Good run at him. And more Ferrellis are going after me. There you go, man. Let's see. He's going to stay here, though, so that's why I'm going to stay as well. See, pay and spray anywhere? Uh, I may have to go to a pain spray. Let me get rid of this one to level. Because it's stuck, because if three star one to level, it's very hard to uh, deal with. When I mean, you get the frig out of here, you dumb cop. 
Let me see, as long as I don't fail the mission right here. Oh, stupid truck. Ooh, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. I just about got busted. That would have been bad. I, oh my god. Okay. Pay and spray. Pay and spray with the free guy. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Okay, I want to get rid of this before I go back to Polly. There we go. All I wanted right there. And yeah, but I was afraid of that. I had no choice right there. I had to do something right there. Or else he was, uh... I had his cops on me, so... Let's see here. Um, I got an idea, guys. Um, I'm actually going to head back to, uh... I'm actually going to go back to the second island of, uh... I should go back to Stalk Island and uh, get me a uh, sniper rifle. And, uh, let's see. Eh, you know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna. That's nah, screw it. I'm just gonna continue it normally, so. So hang on for a moment, guys. Alright, so here we go, guys, for attempt number three. But on my second attempt, I actually found a little bit extra firepower. I actually found myself a rocket launcher underneath the bridge that connects Stalin Island to, uh, Shore Chaville. So real quickly here, let's get her out. Ladies and gentlemen, Wally Sindaco has left the building. <laughs> yes, sir. And one just committed suicide and right into the water. So yeah, uh, basically, um, if you you can actually finish this mission pretty quick if you find yourself a rocket launcher or a minigun from Phil Cassidy's shop. And uh, you can take out the boat in a couple of hits with the rocket launcher. So, so yeah, guys, I'm going to end this video here. Join us next time on Let's Play Grand Theft Auto Liberty City Stories. Um, we'll see what's next. Till then, this is Geek Squad 16 signing out. Later.